Hey guys, this is Amy Lee 33 and welcome back to another episode inside of Amy Lee's Land of Love. I hope everyone had a lovely week and a wonderful weekend. Let's start the episode as we always do and say big hello to my family and I can see Bert hanging out there. Hey Bert, how's it going Bert? How are you sir? You're looking amazing Bert. Are you like picking some blocks to stare at today? He's like, hmm, this block looks nice. I love it. Where's Bertha hanging out at today too? Bertha, where are you big? Oh, mittens. I can tell it's you all. Ways. Mittens are so full of mischief. But where's Bertha? Oh, there she's Bertha! Oh, she's like, seriously, Amy, when are you gonna add everyone? Like, all their blocks and stuff. I really need to do that. I promise I'll do that real soon, okay? I promise. I can add the snow golems and I can add a Romeo and everyone that I'm missing up there. I promise I'll add them, okay? Okay, Bertha, I love you. You're looking so beautiful. You are, you're looking so beautiful. I promise. Look, you're here and there's Bert. We're gonna have like Boomer and Romeo there and we're gonna have the snow golems there too, okay? I promise we'll get that done. Talking of the snow golems, I can see mittens has been causing a lot of mischief today. I wonder where uh, where they are hanging out at today. Are you in here, guys? Mittens, mittens, where is mittens and Mr. Frost and Blizzard? Are they in their little room? Are they actually being good today, like staying in their room? Do you reckon, guys? Where are they? I have no Scooby Doo clue. Anyway, let's go pick ourselves a doggy today to take with us on our little adventure. We've got a lot to do today. Um, so who would like to come with me on today's journey? Who is that in a chest? Hello, who are you? Who are you? You're Romeo. What are you doing in that chest, you silly goose? Anyway, who would like their breakfast? I've got a fishy, a fishy for my Saturn. There you go, my darling. Who would like a baked potato? Anyone? Anyone? Who's this with their head in the corner? Oh, Max, you silly goose. Who would like some lovely juicy steak? Oh, they love it, don't they? Potato steak. They love steak. There you go, Lexi, my cutie. My little dog, Luna. Sailor. We have Lola. Oh, that lag, though. <laughs> Lola. We've got Boomer. We have Romeo. We have Mars. And we have Max. Now, who should I take with me on today's adventure? You know, I'm kind of feeling I want Lexi with me today. My first little doggy. My little girlie. We need some girl time. Come on, Lexi, let's go on today's adventure. I'm a bit worried about the snow columns, though. I mean, usually one of them will be, like, walking around by now. But have you seen that? Why is the door open? Why is the snow outside? Oh, my God, Bert! Why are they, are they outside? Oh, my goodness! We need to follow the trail. Come on, Lexi, I think we've got a mission. Look, the mischief has been made. What even? Um, okay, we're going to go... I guess we just follow the path, right? Um, oh, Grandfather Oak, have you seen the snow golems? Have they been... I hope they're not perished. Um, okay, let's go in this way. Um, okay. Uh, okay, the trail goes quite far. Um, this way... Have they been in the cute recruit patch? Let me have a little look. Uh, what is this? Mittens, Mr. Frost and Blizzard. They added themselves to the cute recruit patch. That's the cutest thing. What even? They are so mischievous, those naughty little golems. I'm going to leave that up there. They deserve to be there. Oh, but let the trail goes this way. Lexi, come on. Let's go see. Um, okay. Hello, little piggy. How are you doing today, sir? Um, okay. So I'm guessing... Where's it going to go? It looks like it's going to the Garden of Peace and Love. Do you reckon they went to visit Peace Pig? Do you reckon that's what they did? I don't even know. How did they even get this far? Peace Pig, are they in here with you? I can see Peace Pig. Let's go see hello to Peace Pig. Come on, Lexi. Hey, Peace Pig, how are you doing, sir? Well, it looks like you've had some visitors today. Are they still in here? Peace Chicken, have you seen them? Peace Pig? Where are they? Look, oh, look, it doubles back on itself. Okay, so they came in here. They must have visited Peace Pig and Peace Chicken. And they must have gone out this way again. Um, come on, Lexi. Oh, look, yeah, they went this way. Okay, we can follow the trail. Um, they are naughty little golems, aren't they? Okay, maybe they wanted to see all the colourful sheep. Um, have you guys seen any snow golems? That way? Okay, oh, yeah, I guess it is this way. I mean, look, there's a big trail going this way. Um... Do you reckon they went in the village? I don't know. They've never been out on their own before. This is a bit unusual. It's a little bit worrying. Um, okay, so we're going this way. Oh, we're going to the dance studio. Are they in here? Are they actually in the dance studio? Um, excuse me? What are you guys doing in here? Mittens! Mittens, don't look at me like that. You're not allowed out on your own, Mittens. You could have got in trouble, Mittens. Mitten, no, look at me, Mittens, look at me. Why did you come out here? You wanted to dance. Oh, they love dancing. Okay, I'm going to let you guys dance. But you really shouldn't do that. Oh, no, now I'm stuck in here. Ah, 
I can't get out. You really shouldn't do that, guys. You could have got in trouble and then I couldn't save you. Like, seriously. I was really worried about you. I'll put some music on. You guys can dance, but you can't be naughty and do that again, okay? It's like a naughty mittens adventure. Right. There you go. There's some music. Are you happy now, mittens? You got some music and you can now dance. Does it make you happy inside? You're so mischievous. I just can't even. Look at all their faces. Mr. Frost. I know it's not all mittens. I know you're a little bit mischievous and blizzard as well. You know what, though? With the music, sometimes I can't help it. I need to have a little dance, Steve. Do you want to dance with me, mittens? We can dance. Lap sip, lap sip, lap sip, lap sip, lap sip. <laughs> I love it. Okay, I, I can't be too mad at you because I know what it's like when you want to dance. And Lexi, what are you doing at the top there? I, got, I just saw you walking around the glass roof. Where are you, Lexi? How did you get there? Mittens, are you happy now you can dance? Oh, he looks a lot happier. We can dance together, Mittens. You know I love you. Love sit fancies, love sit fancies. I can't even magic fancies. <laughs> All these amusements, so Oh, I love it. Okay, well, I can't really be mad at you, but... You really should not run off like that because it does worry me because I care all about you, okay? Um, but anyway, I'm completely like out of sync now. I need to go back to the cute recruit patch and add the person I was gonna add. I saw your name up there. Yes, I did. And I know that was you, you naughty little boy. I love it. Anyway, so I need to go back to the cute recruit patch because I did actually add someone. Look at all this mystery. I'm gonna have to clean that up. Oh, I, I can't. You know what? Those golems love to dance. I can't have a go at them for that. That's, you know, they need to dance. And I haven't danced with them in the happy room for quite some time. So I can't blame them for needing to go and dance for a little while. Um, anyway, yeah, let's go back to the cute recruit patch and see which others we have added today. <laughs> Cheeky little golems. I can't believe that. They're so naughty. I love it. Anyway, so yeah, there's a little pig hanging about there. He's so cute. Uh, I need to have some breakfast myself, actually. Um, but yeah, it's all, it's all good. Now I know that they're safe, I feel a little bit better about my day in general. So let's go see who we have added today, because we have added a really special cutie, and that cutie is up here. Actually, no, because I've just fell down. Can you even? Uh, the cutie I've added today is Alicia Jenkins. Loves it. Now, I've added Alicia Jenkins because she sent me the most amazing picture on Facebook of her Amy Lee 33 Halloween costume, and it was just amazing. Like, I literally cannot even. I'm going to, like, put a picture at the very end of the episode. Like, seeing your Amy Lee costumes is just so amazing and so so beautiful it just makes me smile and it just brings tears to my eyes that you guys would think of me so if you guys are dressing up as me for halloween or dressing up as my friends or whatever please send me the pictures on facebook or twitter and i'll retweet every single one um i just i can't wait to see you guys and like having your diy like your homemade costumes and stuff it's so beautiful so yeah that is why i'm adding you my darling because you're the first like costume i've seen and it's beautiful check out the very end of the episode welcome to the cute recruits you are totally adorable loves it anyway it's night time we have like been on an adventure already trying to find the snow golems but it's actually night time so we're gonna go and sleep and then we need to finish off the little dance club um, and somehow get the snow golems home without them causing too much mischief, which I'm not sure is actually doable. But there's also another thing I really wanted to do, and that was build a sand castle. And I think that's actually on my ideas board in my meter moon. Let me just have a little sneaky peek here. Um, let me have a look. I have, oh, my disco dance room. I mean, that can come off now because I've pretty much done that one. Um, what we've got over here, the rooftop garden is done. Uh, a library, we haven't done a library yet. Um, plant more trees, obviously a tree appreciation, sand castle, there it is, a swimming pool, a beach and an island, and a doggy room. So we've got lots of ideas, and I'd love it if you guys could give me any more ideas down below. Like, if you can put in the comments anything else you want me to build and make and do and stuff in the series, because this is a series where I like to include you guys at home as much as possible. So if you guys have any ideas, please put them down below. But anyway, I need to sleep because we do have some work to do. Um, so good night, everybody. I love all your faces so much. I've got dog hair like all over my pillow seriously it's not cute it's not cute but anyway I need to get some wood and I need to get some sand and I want to make like a little like stage area in the dance club so that if we wanted to like dance around and have a little bit of fun then we can do that um, so let me just get myself some sand and some sandstone so we can actually like start the sand castle if we can in this episode if we have enough time that is and we've got sand there um, we've got sandstone, uh, that should be a plenty for that. 
Um, the crafting table I left over there so I had to get out of the little DJ booth. But this should be pretty good. Um, that should be enough anyway to get us going on our little adventure today. Uh, sorry guys, let me squeeze past you there. I also need to like get my map sorted because like there's still so much I can add on here. I'm wondering like if it updates real time. I don't think it does because I've obviously added a few things to um, my little village. Like my dance club isn't on there and stuff. So maybe I need to update update that a little bit. But, yeah, it's all cool. So anyway, come on then Lexi, let's go and like start this day now that all the golems are like now I know where they are and I don't have to worry about them I could have put a wanted poster out Mittens has gone missing I would die I would actually die if anything happened to them I love them all so much can't even on the love of my snow golems they're the cutest little things but anyway we need to get on with today's episode otherwise I would never get finished um while you guys have been gone, I added like some lovely jubbly love love petals to the side of my little dance club so it's like proper like flower power and all that kind of stuff which is awesome. Um, come on in Lexi, we're going to make like a little stage area. Oh you know what I do need? I need a little bit of cobblestone so I'm just going to grab that from one of these houses here because these houses are going to be knocked down because the villagers left me. They couldn't handle the Amy so they left me but it's all good. And um, so yeah, okay, they're still in here. Hello, crew. How are you doing? <laughs> mittens! Are you trying to put the music on? I can do it, Mittens. I can do it. Don't, like, stress yourself, darling. Uh, let me just move this egg out of the way, and I'll put that on. Um, hello? Di where, where is it, Mittens? Have you got the disc? Where did you put it? Is it in this one? Oh, there it is. Okay. You want some more music, Mittens? Where do you want it? you want it in this one? Does that make you happy inside? Oh, I love him so much. I love it. Right, I'm going to make like a little club, like little stage area over here. Uh, and I'm going to need to put my crafting table down so I can make some stairs. Um, and it's just going to be a very simple like stage area. And then I'm going to put like a lever on there. And the lever will look kind of like a microphone. So maybe I can have people come in and do a little bit of karaoke and sing and stuff like that. I think that will be really cool. But anyway, Mittens, you happy? Mittens. Don't fall down there, Mittens, because I can't get you back out. Mr. Frost! Get off the moving cow's face! <laughs> Stop dancing on his head! Seriously, Mr. Frost, get off his head! <laughs> Poor MC Moo! Mr. Frost, come on now, you naughty little golem. These golems, like, they're a full time job, seriously. I can't leave them alone for like two minutes without them getting into some kind of mischief. Right, guys, you guys really want to sing? Are you excited to sing? Okay, come out of the way. Let me, let me, let me just finish a stage, and maybe you guys can come up and have a little sing song. Excuse me, guys. Thank you. They are just impossible today. Mittens, out of, come mittens out of the way. The microphone isn't on there yet, mittens. You just gotta wait. They can't even. Right, we'll put some stairs down here. Right, Blizzard, Mr. Frost, can, um, Mittens, can you please just move out the way? Just a little bit. Let me just finish my job, please. You shouldn't even be here. You should be back home. Right, okay. So we've got, like, a little stage area, and we can just put, like, a little microphone, maybe, like, here. And pff, Mittens is a little bit overexcited to get this done. Okay, so we're going to put, um, I think, to make a lever, we just want some stickles, like so. And then we just want, like, a lever, things like that. There we go. Okay. So we can put, like, a little lever up here. And then anyone who would like to sing, we can come up here and be like, love, 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 We can all have a little sing song and stuff. It would be quite cute. Mittens, you want to have a go? You're going to sing? Have a little sing song, Mittens. Are you getting a bit stage fright now? I thought you wanted to come up here to sing. Mr. Frost wants to sing now. Go on, Mr. Frost. You can have a little sing. I think they're a little bit nervous. Oh, now Blizzard is up here spinning on the Moo Cow Can you not, Blizzard? That poor MC Moo. He's trying to do his job and you're just like dancing on his head. Seriously, I can't even. These golems. I, I, I can't. Right, I'm going to leave you guys here. I'm going to pick you up at the end of the episode. I'm going to take you back home, okay? I don't want you escaping again. Cheeky little fellas. Anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and start my little sandcastle now because my dance club is pretty much complete. Um, and I thought it'd be a really cool like place to make it, like near my mermaid's room. Do you know the room I'm talking about? The underwater room that I made ages ago, and I really don't use it often enough. So I thought if I could make like a little sandcastle just above that, and then maybe it can lead into that little music music room, into the little mermaid room. I think that'd be really cool. Um, so yeah, I've never really made a sandcastle before, but I want it looking like a giant, like, a giant mini sandcastle, if that makes sense. <laughs> Hello, Peronies, how are you? Tinker Bell, a journey, and my lovely Gabriel, too. I love it. Um, but yeah, if you haven't seen my mermaid room, it's just a very simple underwater room, and I like to go there sometimes when I need to fill out one with the ocean. Um, but I do need to get probably a little bit more sand, maybe, I don't know, we should see. 
Um, but yeah, the mermaid room is over here. You can just about see it underwater there. I like to go under there and I like to see the squiddies like go over. It's really cute. I'll show you what I mean if in case you like miss the episode. But if I go down here, we all the way down here. And there should be a little door here. There we go. Love set. I need to make sure my little Lexi don't drown there. But yeah, I can like sit here and have a little fun and see the squiddies like swim over and stuff. So it's really good fun. But I need to make sure uh, my doggies don't drown. So I just need to come back up. Uh, Lexi, you okay? Lexi, don't perish. You're okay. You're okay. You okay, Lexi? You okay? Lexi? Lexi, where are you? Lexi, come to mummy. Where is she? <gasps> Lexi? You, Lexi? Lexi, please don't mess around now. You're scaring me, Lexi. Where is she? Oh, there she is. Oh, my goodness. You scared me so much. Right, I'm going to have you sitting up here, Lexi, just in case there is a lot of, like, water stuff. And I really don't want you getting hurt and drowned. That's a word. I invented it just now. Drowned. So I'd like you to sit just right here. You can shake it out. That's fine. Um, so, yeah, we're going to start a little sandcastle, like, probably around here somewhere and have, like, a little door leading into my mermaid room. Uh, so maybe, like, we could start it, like, here. And we'll make it like, um, probably like the same kind of size, maybe? Uh, let's have a little look. How big is this room? We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, I think? So maybe I could just have it like... Because I don't... It doesn't need to be too big, but that kind of looks like in the middle roughly, doesn't it? I mean, I mean we can always like fix it up if it's not in the middle um so yeah we don't need it absolutely humongous but we want it like a nice big size that we can have some fun in it and stuff um and then we can have like any adventures that we need to have like any seaside adventures and games and stuff we can play in the sandcastle so that's really cool so yeah we're just gonna have like a basic square shape like you know the sandcastles you make at the ocean at the beach and stuff that's what i want it to look like like a proper sandcastle like vintage and traditional like that there we go okay so we probably need to fill this up um, so I probably will need to get some more sand, so we may have to like run to the desert and stuff and get some more sand. But that's pretty okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, that is so not enough sand. I mean, come on, Amy, come on. Um, so yeah, let me just finish this little bit, and then we'll run over to the desert, which is just there, and we can get some more sand and be on our way for making our sand castle. Yeah, we need to do that like right now. Uh, so the sand is this way, or the desert, rather. Um, so yeah, it's going to be really cool. I love, like, sandcastles. Like, I love going to the beach. Even now, like, if I go to the beach, it's like, I really want to make a sandcastle. Like, sandcastles are just awesome, right? Let me just have some breakfast or lunch or dinner. What is it? It's, like, dinner time right now. Um, where's my shovel? Get my shovel ready. And we'll put that there. There we go. Okay, loves it. So we need to get a load, a huge bunch of sand. Um, so yeah, it should be really fun. La 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 la. Yeah, have you seen those people that do like immense like sand work, like real sand art and stuff? Like they make these humongous castles or like like figures of stuff, like huge horses and stuff, like out of sand. It's like wow, they're so beautiful. I used to like making like sand sofas when I was younger, like literally making a humongous sofa and just chilling on it, and it'd be like, yeah, I'm a boss man. I just feel like such a queen of the ocean doing that. It's awesome. And like when people bury you and stuff, and it's like crazy. I love the ocean. I miss it. I used to live by the ocean. I used to get it every single day, like in real life, because I'm a real mermaid. I used to, I really miss it. I really should go back. But it's okay. It's all good. Right, how much sand is that? Uh, it's just over a stack and a half. That's pretty good. So maybe two or three stacks would, like, see us, like, way plenty. Like, more sand would be really good. La 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 la. La 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 I wonder what these golems are up to. I can't stop thinking about them now. I wonder if they're like causing any more mischief and dancing on cows' heads and stuff. So naughty, aren't they? I'm telling you, if you have snow golems, it's like taking like care of a bunch of children. Like, don't do it if you can't handle it. Seriously, I can't. Don't think I could cope with any more snow golems. <laughs> they're naughty. I always thought maybe I should get another one. You know, it's like having a child. It's like should I get and have another baby? But yeah. They're, they're hard work. They're not for the faint-hearted, these little cheeky, mischievous golems. Um, anyway, let's get on with this magic moment. Um, awesome. Okay, so then we're just going to build the walls up. I love the texture of sand in this as well. Like, it really looks like sand, doesn't it? Like, it really looks good. Um, so we need... Uh, is it going to be a double door or a one door? I think it's going to be a double door castle. Um, I will need to just make sure that, like... Um, it is equal because it will like bug me if it's not so what we can do is uh how many we've we got one two three four 
four spaces at the edge of that building. And we've got what? One, two, three, four. Yeah, okay, I think that's right, right? This is double, 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 double check. Uh, no, because that's glass there. So I think it may need to just be altered just a little bit. Uh, I think it may need to go, like, get rid of... Yeah, I need to get rid of one side, I think. Okay. I'm really peculiar. Like, things have to, like, match, like, and be even. It really annoys me when it's not. I don't know why. Do you guys get that with Minecraft? Like, things have to be, like, symmetrical and stuff. I know the worst person for that is Squid Nugget. He needs things to be symmetrical, otherwise it upsets him. <laughs> I love it. Um, okay, how are we doing on this now? So, yeah, so the single door there. Okay, so that probably is symmetrical now, but I will double check that and fix it if it's not. We can just build these walls up, and it's getting night time. Maybe I should sleep. Maybe I should sleep in the Enchanted Treehouse. We haven't been in there for so long. Um, let's just get the little bit that we can done now. Uh, like that, there we go. And obviously we can not put sand across that bit, so we're going to have to use some sandstone so it doesn't fall. Like that, that's really cool. And then we can just carry on and build the walls up. And obviously, whatever we don't get done, we can finish off in another episode and stuff. Um, so let me just finish this little bit here. La, 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 la. I need a quite tall because obviously sand castles are quite tall and I've got like the little bit at the top like the little castle bit and stuff I could have this like a double like have like a upstairs and stuff and this could also be someone's house if they wanted to come and stay here and they didn't want to stay in the house they could just like stay in the sand castle it could be good but anyway we have just run out of time for today's episode. It's gone by super quick with all the mischief of those golems and stuff. It's been awesome. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave me some comments down below on anything that you guys want me to make or build in this series. Because like I say, this is the series where I get to include you guys as much as possible. So yeah, give me some like tips and stuff and anything you want me to build. And I always read the comments. I know I can't reply to every single one. I wish I could, but that would be like a full-time job in itself. But know that I love you all so so much and I like have you all in my heart all the time um, and if any of you are dressing up as me or any of my Minecraft friends for Halloween please tweet the pictures to me I will retweet every single picture you guys tweet of me and um, yeah so I can't wait to see any of that and also you can send it to me on my Facebook as well and that is all like down below so you can go check that out but yeah thank you guys so much for watching don't forget guys Amy loves you bye guys